Hail! Stranger! Please! Uh, I am in danger! Uh, help! Uh, please, help! My ankle is hurt and some bad men want to skin me and I need my skin for living. Ow, 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 ow! Uh, my ankle got caught in one of their chompy things. They said they were going to sell me off to some crooked wizard when they undid the chomper. Then I kicked one in the groin with my good leg, headbutted the other guy in his groin, and then I ran. But they're still chasing me. I'm sorry. I don't mean to be a burden, but please, please don't let them hurt me anymore. Oh no, here they come. Come on, we need to run. Run, 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 run. There's like 12 of them, and they've all got swords and crossbows. Are any of them magics? I, I don't know. I don't think so. What? Your staff is gl glowing with lightning. What's happening? It's so loud. You talk to the planets, to the skies, but the only people that... You, you're... You hit them all with lightning, and, and they just fell over dead before you even saw them. How? Oh, you're a battle mage. Wow. I was wondering why you had such sparky armor, especially out in this neck of the forest. But wait, the last humans that came out this way said that the only battle mage that survived the big battle was the warrior named... Grey. That's what they called them. Are you... The warrior named Grey? Sorry, is that okay to ask? I'm bad at talking, and I do it so much. Like, a lot. Sorry, I'm so nervous. Please don't hurt me. I'll put a bandana in my mouth. You're not talking, but you're not hitting me either, so... I don't think you're mad. That's okay. We don't need to talk about it. And I'm sorry if it's painful to you, for one reason or another. I know how hard it can be to talk about painful stuffs. Would it be okay if I called you Grey? See, I don't really have a name, per se. These blotches burned into the fur on my legs look like clouds. A little. So, I call myself Cloudy. And if you're gray, then, you know, we'd be... Eh? Yeah? Yay! Cloudy and gray. Gray and cloudy. So, hey, do you have a favorite color? Because your cloak is kind of holy, but I'm real good at sewing, so I can make you a nicer cloak. Uh, you look like you'd be really dapper in blue. No, red. No, yellow. I wouldn't mind. You saved my life and all, so the least I could do is make you a nice present. I'll find some pretty stones to put in the hem. Yeah. It helps keep your cloak from flying off you in the wind. Plus, some people like the extra weight. Or or just having some lucky stones with them. You know. Huh? Why would you need to come back for it? C come back where? Oh, no. I don't, uh... I don't got to home village. Or a home. I usually sleep in a hollowed-out tree. 
Oh, man. They burned my tree. Well, where do I think we're going, then? We'll off on an adventure together. It'll be so much fun. We could keep each other company and trade stories and cook over a campfire. Oh, I can learn how to start a campfire. Maybe, maybe I'll learn how to be less useless. I try my best, but I've never been very bright or, or very anything. But that's good, because it means I'll do all the gross work without complaining. Oh, you don't want a traveling companion. But I could be useful. I promised I could be super useful, and we just became friends, right? Please? Oh, wait. Please, 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 could I stay with you? I'll be a useful companion. I promise. I'll sleep out in the cold, and I'll feed myself. And I can carry stuff. Not, um, heavy, like your fancy stuff, but other things. I I know how to find truffles and, and how to tell plants apart from whether they're poisonous or not. Uh, I'm a decent cook, and I promise I'll do anything. Just please. It depends? Uh, on what? Nothing could change my mind. Well, I mean, necromancy might be a little weird, but no, I can handle gross corpse stuff, P probably. Whether I think your quest is good or evil? Uh, hmm. I don't think I really know the difference, you know? I live in nature, and nature kind of just does what it wants. A praying mantis bites heads, but only because it's stressed, you know? I think. I hope. Can humans bite each other's heads off if you're stressed? No? Okay, I didn't think so. But I don't run into humans a lot. Uh, are you human? You're not gonna tell me? Oh, but I can't tell. I mean, I guess you're not a naga or a werewolf, but... Oh, but you're a mage. You might be able to shapeshift. That's amazing. You're amazing, Gray. Please, please, can I be part of your amazing quest? Oh, yeah. I guess I should know what it is. Probably. Well, what is your quest, then? Your quest is to murder your ex-lover. The...